There's little Luna. She's a little dog. Oh yes. Where's she gone now? Oh, she's sneaking around up the trails. Come on, little Luna. Luna, come. Come on. Come on. Ah, there's Bear. Good as gold bear is. Bear always comes when you call her. She's a real good dog. And a bit of water. Oh, there's Cubby. Now, Cubby is the best behaved dog. Cubby's the leader of the pack. You know, where Cubby goes, others follow. But of course, Cubby's also the one where she does know about Star and Toby being the slow ones and the ones that can't walk that far. And uh, she looks out for him. So if Star sort of like tells her in his dog way that he's had enough, Bear tells me that they've had enough. And we come back. And this really for Star is about, because it's got, we've got hills, you see, so we don't really want to no, go up all the hills. <laughs> we'll just see what's on this bit up here. Because it's going to flatten out. It flattens out here. <clears throat> Ah, uh -huh, there's a Luna. Now she's so excited because it's the first time she's ever been here. Anyway, so we're not going to go much further. Let's have a little, little rest. There's the Toby and Star. Mr. Star and little Miss Toby. Yes, the old members of the gang. Well, we're all old members of the gang nowadays. Star's 13. Whew. We love him to pieces. And where's Heli? We've lost Heli. But you see this here, this is like a like a concretey road. This once upon a time was one of the roads that you take. And if you follow this, it then ends up going into a hill and there was a little there was houses there many years ago. There's no houses there now. They've long gone. Um, but this was a road and this eventually, if you kept on following this and this and this, you'd end up in Sanchez. Um, it's not passable anymore um, because it's been fenced by the landowners. But it was actually a road which they'd put in because it was all their land. So it was a road that they did to circumnavigate their properties, which is massive. OK, so goodbye and have a, a very nice, enjoyable Sunday. Good morning, it's me, Douglas, and today we're on a dog walk. Luna's coming out. Now, Luna had to have a caesarean, not caesarean, sorry, uh, to be sterilized. Um, so she hasn't been able to walk for a couple of weeks because of that little operation. We had a spade. So now she's had her stitches out the other day and she's all keen as mustard. So she's out now walking with the rest of the gang. And poor old Star. He can't walk up and down hills because he's 13 years of age. Bless him, look at him. Oh, he's a strong boy though. But his back legs are sort of not good for hills. So we have to take them out in the car now. So I can't do these big, long, massive walks that we used to do many years ago. And Toby's not very good either. She's, we don't know how old Toby is, but we're guessing Toby's at least, uh, could be nine or 10. And she's got a twisty little way, as you know. And Cubby's, uh, coming up to eight it's amazing how time flies she's almost eight but she's still a real fitness dog little cubby and then there's heli in front with little luna so heli thinks she knows where she's going but she's never been here before so bear's gonna round her up because we, sh we were gonna go that way but we, we will go this way now okay so we're on our usual little team there's Star, watering the bushes. It's a good boy. And this is the, oh, I should show those lovely flowers. They're really unusual. It's like a, a yellow flowery bush thing. They're crazy. But this is the old quarry. Well, one of the old quarries. There's lots of them where they quarried all this caliche. You see all this stuff here, which they use as aggregates and road fill and all this business. And back in the old and in the day, there's a trail that runs up there, as you can see. And we get onto the top and then we, we can stand right up on the top there, which we used to do. All, all the puppies we used to get up there right on top of that cliff. And, uh, and then there's trails over the back that we used to use. 
so you can see it's all grown and getting wilderness and there's not many people that use these trails anymore but we're you know, just us and a few farmers okay so signing off So this is little Sorry, Luna. This is our new little doggy. She's a little dog that we've just adopted. We've had to go to Santa Domingo to get her. Because she couldn't live there any longer. The people were moving. And so we've got her. Oh, don't fall in with the fish, Luna. This is her first... 10 minutes at the house and of course she's a bit nervous so <laughs> she went for star <laughs> stars now luna no so she's snapping at star she's got a nice little face they're all trying to make friends with her hello she's so pretty he's a good girl come here you little rascal let's have a look at you it's all new isn't it it's very frightening you've come to a big house in a different town and everything yeah yeah oh, yes look at that <laughs> all ready for the walks luna's got a new little harness because she pulls on a lead so she's all excited a star leader of the pack bear a slinky one and there's beautiful toby what's going back toby beautiful. Uh, toby doesn't have a lead because she's real good toby's a good girl Anyway, so there's all our puppies. We're ready to go on our stroll. Little Luna, the outside world and adventures. Look at those beautiful three there. Camera, action, star star. Cubby's there. And Luna's disappeared.